Boom shakalaka. Today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the top seven crypto projects to scoop out at a steep discount, plus some very interesting news you definitely want to hear. Stay tuned. What's up, everyone? Randall here from Crypto Love. Today's video, we're taking a look at the top seven crypto projects to scoop out at a steep discount discount and some interesting news today before we get into things guys make sure to like subscribe click the notification bell also come join us over on twitter at the crypto love and today neutral 52 guess what people aren't fearful they aren't greedy they're just neutral and i feel the same way now as a whole today if we take a look the total market cap down 11.25 percent most likely due to news from the fed but the big coins on the top of the first page look at this they didn't drop at all bitcoin at 44.78 ethereum at 31.46 bnb at 429 xrp at 84 cents cardano 109 solana 102 avalanche 98 and terra luna 56 dollars and i just want to remind you guys that in the grand scheme of things we are not anywhere near the top and we are not anywhere near a bear market either for all these people who have been saying bear market this whole time bear markets don't occur until the cbbi.info is in this deep green. Those were bear markets, and I can testify to that. I was through a lot, a long bear market. Right now, we're just barely touching green, not in bear market territory. But we have some very interesting news going on right now. So Russia, a lot of people have been scared about Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies and other investments because of, you know, issues with Russia. But Russia is saying that banning Bitcoin would be the same as banning the Internet. It just doesn't work. Well, kind of. I mean, it's working pretty well for China. But for other places, it just wouldn't work. You can't ban the Internet. It's a protocol. It'll get out there no matter what. As a matter of fact, in Colorado right now, the governor's saying he expects the state to accept tax payments in crypto by summer. This further valid valid validates cryptocurrency, saying that, hey, if you can pay for your taxes in it, guess what? Legal tender. We will accept it everywhere now on twitter right now you are in you are able to give ethereum tips natively so as of right now you need the full ethereum address you can't use the eth uh, ens domain name yet but that is coming and you're able to give ethereum tips natively and lastly we have oil giant conoco phillips guess what reducing gas flaring emissions by using bitcoin mining now in the beginning people were saying bitcoin isn't green but look at this they're cleaning up a very very non-green industry like oil mining with the gas flares by using that energy to mine bitcoin how cool volcanoes are mining bitcoin waterfalls are mining bitcoin now we have gas flares mining bitcoin how freaking cool which brings us to today's episode of the top seven coins to scoop up at a discount today definitely worth taking a look at so for these we go to token metrics analytics ratings now this gives us a tm grade looks at artificial intelligence machine learning over 80 different indicators to pick out the best coins and this is on a daily one because everything's changing very quickly right now so because of that, if you want to try out token metrics, there is a discounted link down in the description. This discount is pretty darn huge. It doesn't stick around forever. So try it out for yourself. But if we take a look, because I have a feeling that smart contract platforms will continue to do well. They've just done well forever, and they're going to continue doing well forever. So if we take a look at the top smart contract platforms today, the ones that you could likely get a good deal well, first one would be DeFi Chain. Now, this one's interesting. Native DeFi for Bitcoin. Fast, intelligent, decentralized financial services accessible to everybody. They have a wallet. They have decentralized assets. But best of all, aside from all their variety throughput security, it's basically built on Bitcoin, which is pretty interesting. You get DeFi built on Bitcoin. Very, very interesting concept. It marries the best of proof of stake with the security and immutability of Bitcoin. Bitcoin, definitely one worth taking a look at right now at $3.75. The next one would be Elrond. No surprise to anybody. This one has been along, around for a long time. I would say it's one of the more underrated blockchains at the moment. I mean, people are going wild about Solana. They're going wild about Cardano still. But Elrond has always been kind of the next level down. Well, this one could potentially, if we have... A pump in smart contract platforms this one could do it because it's fast 
scalable, and secure. It, does, it checks all the boxes. You can stake, get your rewards, and everything. You can even buy it with Visa or MasterCard so you can go into debt buying crypto. That sounds like a great idea. So that's number two. The third one would be Line Blockchain, designed for everyone. Now, this one's interesting because this is a company that has a messaging service in Southeast Asia, but they've built a blockchain where anybody can build blockchain services to grow their businesses and use their token economy, open to the public, allowing issuing tokens and implementing blockchain technology. Definitely interesting to use because they already have a very large user base in Southeast Asia. So that's the third one, Line Blockchain. Which brings us to the fourth one, should be no surprise, but Avalanche, still significantly undervalued compared with a lot of the other projects out there, considering all that it can do, considering how fast, how low cost, how eco-friendly it is, the potential for this one could be huge. Now, that one's no surprise. The next one, though, Tron may be a surprise. Tron has been around for quite a while. We recently know Justin Sun stepped down from Tron, but potentially this one could be expanding to different ecosystems all types of things that Tron's doing, well, potentially this could be one worth taking a look at. Which brings us to Secret. Now, Secret's a very interesting one because of Web3. Web3 is like the the latest, greatest keyword. Everybody wants to do Web3 because, yeah, exactly. Because it's a keyword. But this is data privacy platform for Web3 because you know with the internet, with technology, with IoT, with cameras, there's no such thing as privacy anymore. But potentially with Secret, using Secret, well, we could have some privacy now historically at least from my experience and this is an n of one because it's just my experience i haven't seen very many privacy projects do well because while in theory it sounds like a great thing on paper we don't see them like succeeding to the levels we do but you know things could be different for secret because it's a secret which brings us to the last one ontology trust redefined this one's been around for years as old as tron or, yeah, that's pretty much it. Tron and Ontology are probably the oldest two out there. Now, this is Trust Redefined. And if we take a look at this one, one of the big things this has is Ontology ID. So this allows you to have a real ID online, but also they have their wallets. They have a DeFi lending protocol called Wing Finance. They have their decentralized protocol for purchasing and monetizing data. So they have a whole bunch of stuff going on there with Ontology. So based on token metrics, and this is artificial intelligence machine learning. They're saying that out of all the different hundreds of 125 smart contract platforms out there, including some of the big names like Solana, like Ethereum, like some of the other ones that people may be gangbusters for, out of all of them on a daily time frame, these are the top seven worth taking a look at today. So if you haven't checked out Token Metrics, there is a discounted link down in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you later. Have a good one. Peace.